What's up you lean, mean, strength machines? Coach Joe coming at you here at the Lion's Den. If you guys have some shoulder problems, shim show to show to have pra problems. <laughs> All right guys, Coach Joe coming at you with some tips to help shoulder problems or shoulder mobility drills that I do. I'm dealing with a problem right now, so this is just a couple tips that help me, so I figured I'm working on it, you guys can too. Okay guys, so the first drill that I normally do is I just get a green road band. I'll put my arm through, uh, right almost on, like, on top of the elbow, and then I'll turn around do the arm bar to myself, so pulling that arm tight and securely, and then I'll turn away from where the band is, and I'll just sit in this stretch for about two minutes. Um, I'll flex and then relax to try to get more of a stretch in the muscle tissue, but I feel like this really helps uh, with opening up the shoulder and getting in between the scapula. Okay guys, so tip two requires some sort of med ball. This is a 20 pound med ball, uh, and then just a road band. I like to use the blue, because this one is very uh, tense for me, so I don't use the green. What you're gonna wanna do is strap it to the end of a, uh, or bottom of a rig, hand through, loop it around, and then you're going to flip over top of the ball, make sure you get right on that scapula, and just hang out here. So we're just gonna camp out here, move around a little bit. Some areas are gonna be more tense than others. And just let that band do the work for two minutes. Uh, as you notice, my hips are on the ground. So my hips aren't up. I'm using that to anchor my weight down to get a better stretch. Okay guys, so for tip three, all you need is a lacrosse ball. What we're gonna to wanna to do is take this lacrosse ball and put it right in the top of the trap. And we can actually work from the trap down through the scapula. So start off by putting it in the top of the trap. We're gonna put some weight on there. You'll feel that right away. And from there, what we wanna do is just raise our arm straight up into an overhead position and then back down. And then we can even go out to the side and then back in. So I like to work this range of motion to just destroy any knots that are built up. From there, I'll roll down a little deeper, punt around, think I found something, come up. Or even if I wanted to, I could go diagonal across. What that's gonna do is close the scapula and kind of just crush anything that's going on in there, getting rid of all that gum. So we'll just work here, up and down, side to side, for two minutes, guys. Okay guys, for the last tip, same thing, lacrosse ball. One thing that I see is that when my pec gets super tight, I tend to round my shoulder forward. So if I'm doing movements with a rounded shoulder, over time it's just gonna get so much junk trapped into that pec. So what we wanna do is take that lacrosse ball, put it right in the insertion point of the pack, go against our wall, and just dig on in there. So we're gonna press, you can also do the arm bar again to get a little bit deeper in there, and just roll back and forth until we mash up all that gunk. So thanks for watching guys, please subscribe, and leave your comments below, there you have it.